Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Jose Alfredo. Hello, how are you? I very tired, teacher. Oh, really? Yeah. You tired? Why? Uh, uh, why? Um, because. Ah, perdón. Because. Uh, very work. A lot of work. A lot of work. Mm -hmm. Ah, eso se dice mucho trabajo. A lot of yep. work. A lot of work. Uh, y en uh, today play soccer. Oh, really? Yes. Uh, uh, apretado. Muy apretado. Very tight. Very uh, very tight. El, uh, el today soccer very tight. Oh, the match. The match was very tight. The match. El partido. Okay. The match. Ah, the match. Ah, the match. The match very tight. Oh, really? Uh, one or one. One or one. Oh, uh, it was a tie. Marcador. It was a tie. It was a tie. Yeah, it was a tie. A tie is the game was a tie, or the game was tie. Okay. Okay. Was a tie. Was tie is uh, empate. Empate. Ah. The game was what's a tie, a tie, a yeah. tie, yeah? no, a tie, a yeah, tie, a tie, like this, a tie. Okay, a tie. Okay, so you like playing soccer. Where do you play? Close to your house or close to your job? Donde juega? Close to your house or close to your job? No, no, les, no, no lo escucho, teacher. No, okay. no sé si mi internet. Let me check. Mm -hmm. Let's see. What about you guys? Can you hear me? ¿Me escuchan los demás? Yes, yo sí. Hoy sí, hoy sí. Yes, teacher, I okay, hear you. Ok, ok, ok. <coughs> Okie dokie. So, it's close to your job or close to your house? ¿Es cerca de su casa o cerca de su trabajo? Me, teacher. That you play. ¿Dónde juega? Ah, uh, uh, my work. Okay, that's nice. That's okay. That's great. <laughs> That's excellent. That's excellent. Well, so good to have you here. Qué bueno tenerlo acá. We are going to practice something very interesting tonight. Tenemos algo muy interesante para esta noche. Welcome, Jose Alfredo. Thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. So let's see who else is around. Veronica Elizabeth Burgos. Hello. Hello good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you, miss? I'm fine. Okay, that's cool. I like to hear that. <laughs> And tell me. What about you? How was your day? Um, pretty cool because I I was um 
I don't know what it, what it said. I I have to go to Santa Ana. Oh, really? Yeah, I like it when I go to another department. Department. Or another city. Department. Okay. Yeah. Department. Okay. okay. Yeah, I like it. The only thing I don't like is traffic. Oh. How was the weather over there? ¿Qué tal estuvo el clima? How was uh, the weather? Was was uh, cool. No, it's not it's not very hot. It's cool. The, the weather is okay. fine. That's cool. Yeah, because I hate it when it's hot. You odio cuando está caliente, man. But uh, when I when I go in driving, I I go in with we con air conditioner. Uh, air conditioner, yes. Then in the office, air conditioner. Oh, too. so not a problem for you. <laughs> no. That's no great. I enjoy it with in my work. <laughs> yeah, that's great. What about when you get home? Uh, I arrive on five o'clock this At day. Five o'clock. That's early or late? It's early for me. Oh, that's cool. In general, I arrive on seven thirty. I usually arrive. I usually arrive at yes, seven thirty. At seven thirty, yes. Okay, yeah, that's nice. That's cool. You could get home early. That's awesome. That's awesome. Yeah, me, uh, the same. I arrive home at five thirty today. Well, every day I arrive home at five thirty, and let's see. I was supposed to have a class from seven to eight, but they canceled, so I went to the gym. I stayed at the gym for one hour and a half. Then I came back home, and I'm here. And let's see, tonight I got class from here until 11 p.m. So it's, it's cool. Tomorrow's going to be horrible for me. Tomorrow I got class from 7 p.m. to 11 p.m. That's crazy. But, seven. yeah, from 7 to 11. Gonna be fun tomorrow. Va a estar divertido. Fun, too. Yeah. Hey, Veronica. Welcome. Nice having you here. Hey, thank you, teacher. Thanks. Jocelyn. Hello, Jocelyn. How are you? Jocelyn Melendez. Hello. Perhaps. Oh, okay, no problem. No problem, Jocelyn. No problem. Be safe. Be safe. That's okay. Let me know when you are available, please. Me avisa cuando ya se pueda. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. No, no. Don't worry. Don't worry. We are cool. We are cool. Okay, guys. We are just fine. Okay. I'm sorry. Let's see. Eh, 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 eh. Hey, lady. How are you? Hi. I'm fine. And you? I'm just fine. I'm cool, you know. Chilling. <laughs> yeah. How's everything? How was your day? Um, I am. Uh, I was in the office. At the office. At the office. Yeah, because I don't know your office. If I knew your office, you could tell me in. Okay. Si yo ya conociera, usted me diría in the office, because, oh, it's some place that I know. But as I don't know, you tell me at the office. Okay. Thank you. Oh, really? So, no field work today? No hubo trabajo de campo? No. Okay. What do you prefer, being in the office or going out? Um, but. Both. Both. Okay. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I think in my <laughs> case, I, I would rather go out. It's funny. Yeah, I can imagine. Yeah, and you go <laughs> visit different places. How's the weather over there? How's um... the weather? ¿Qué tal el clima? Cool. Um, hay lugares que son muy fríos. Okay. The, some places. Some places. Are very cold. 
are very cold. Oh, man, I would love that. A mí me encantaría eso. Hay pinos. Hay... Oh, man, yeah, lovely. Es la montaña, es increíble. Oh, Por eso me gosh. gusta salir y estar en la oficina. Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah, of course, of course. You know, I was living for five years up in a mountain. Yo me viví cinco años en la montaña, in a job that I had, en un trabajo que tuve. Man, it was so nice. I loved it. Me encantaba. And I was working my specialty. Estaba en mi área. And I was working with the... Well, actually, I was working with Americans over there. Estaba trabajando con una comunidad de norteamericanos. So it was fun. You know here? No. No, no. I was working in the mountains, but here at uh, Cordillera del Bálsamo. Yo estaba en la Cordillera del Bálsamo. Mm. But I was all the way up to the top. Estaba en la cumbre. So, yeah, actually, that was the name of it. Así se llamaba. It's nice and very oh cold. I love it. I love the cold weather. You know, I hate the heat. Odio el calor. <laughs> I mean, when it's too hot, I feel sleepy. I feel uncomfortable. But when it's cold, I am like, oh, it's fine. Yeah, like at home, I cannot sleep, not even with a blanket. Yo no puedo usar ni una sábana. I mean, that's terrible for me. Here is perfect for you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll I'll transfer over there. Uh, voy a pedir un traslado. <laughs> <laughs> well, lady, nice having you here in class. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Claudia Pineda. Hello, Claudia. Hello, good evening. Go ahead, go ahead. Good evening, Claudia. How's everything? Excuse me? How's everything? ¿Qué tal todo? Ah, uh, I feel very well. Okay, how was your day? Mm, my day was relaxed. A relaxed day? Man, I love that. Yes. A relaxing day. That's cool. I wonder what those are yes. like. They have told me they are nice. Ya me han contado esos días. Dicen que son bonitos. I wish <laughs> I knew them. <laughs> nah, it's okay. It's okay. That's nice. And what about uh, what time you got home? I could have uh, casa. Around the five thirty minutes. Five thirty. Mm, that's yes. cool. That's yes, nice. Because, so, yeah, tell me, tell me. Because I work near at my home. Oh, I work near home. I work near yes, home. Near home. That's nice. Wow. Yeah, I wish I would. Yes. Well, no, I work near home, but not that near. That's I walk cool. every day. <laughs> oh my gosh, you walk to your job? <laughs> oh my gosh, that's close. Eso es cerca. If you got yes. to walk, how long does it take you walking? ¿Cuánto camina? Uh, around 15 minutes. Yeah, it's close. It's close. Yes. Yeah, it's yes. very close. You know where I work? That's where I walk to get the bus. Donde yo trabajo, eso es lo que se camina para abordar el bus. Yes. I mean, it's different. Well, that's nice. So happy for you, Claudia, and welcome to the class. Thank you. Hey, Julio. Hello. How are you? Hello. I'm fine. How are you? I'm Where just you? fine, you know. How was your day? Well, how's everything? Uh, my day was, I think, wonderful. Oh, nice. I nice. Don't... <laughs> you don't... Uh... You don't have complaints. Yes. That's nice. I didn't have a, a lot of chat. A lot of work. No. Oh, that's cool. I think... Yeah. You know, in my case, in my area, when I don't have a lot of work, it's boring. Because I'm used to be dealing with people all day. So when I'm not like that, man, I'm like this. And in the afternoon, I'm like, oh, my gosh, I want this to end. For me, but it's because of my job. Es debido a, 
the, the, the peculiarities of my job. I mean, I'm always with people, so I feel weird when there's no people. Siento raro cuando no tengo gente. So, uh, what I well, did... I... Yeah, tell me, tell me. I... I... I don't have a lot of people uh, around 50 person. Okay. Oh, that's but nice. When I when I have to to prepare a, a lot of document only I will only stay in the desk. Okay. So, so it's a little wonderful to me. Oh, yeah. It's a little wonderful for me. Yeah, we are for totally me. opposites. Man, paperwork for me is like, ah, I hate doing paperwork. In my case, doing paperwork means planning classes and checking out uh, homework, assignments, preparing stuff. It's boring. I mean, I get like sleepy. I can do paperwork in the morning. In the afternoon, uh, uh, no, man, if I start doing paperwork in the afternoon, I get crazy. Well, Julio, okay. nice having you here. Welcome. Thanks. Okay. Hello, Ruth. You around? Ruth Asensio. Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Perdón, me acaba de dar un ataque de todo. No problem, no problem. Ay, lo siento, por eso no va a activar el micrófono. No problem. If you want, we can talk later, ¿ok? Ok, teacher, thank you. No problem. Carlos Miguel, hello. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you, mister? I'm fine. Great. Yeah, I can and tell. You? I can tell. You are relaxed. That's cool. I like that. I'm just fine. Just fine. What about you? How was your day? Oh, my day is very easy. Very, um, very easy. Um, um very. Uh, <laughs> okay. Well. Wow, almost everybody had a good day, relaxing day. That's cool because in the middle of the week, man, sometimes Wednesdays are like uh, tough. A veces los miércoles son cansados. But it's so good to hear that uh, you guys had a good day. Yeah, tell me. It was my easy day. That's nice. Um, um well, I'm... I'm I'm going to work uh, to seven o'clock and out uh four or PM. PM yes. Uh, that's a long schedule. Está largo. <laughs> yeah. Well, and at what time do you arrive to your job? Ya que horas llega al trabajo. Um. The six thirty AM. Okay, that's that's cool. So you get enough time to 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 relax mm. before starting. <laughs> eh, aunque me levanto. What time do you wake up? I wake at four four Okay, that's the bad part. Es <laughs> lo feo. Yes, yeah, wake, ah. waking up that early is not good. This traffic is hard. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, I wake up. In my case, it's different. I wake up at 5. I leave my home at 5.30. And at 6, I am in my work already. Mm. I am in my nice. job at 6. But the problem is that I start working until 7. So I have breakfast. I relax. I read a little bit. Me pongo a leer, and then I start working. Ah, uh, you leave at what time? I leave my house at five. No, well, at... Uh, your work, your work. Whoa. I finished teaching at 4.10. 
but uh, I leave the place at 10 to 5 or 5. Around 5. Uh, how many classes do you give? Okay, how many classes do you teach? Ah, uh, do you teach? Mm, during the day, like 10. Wow. Yeah, 10 hours. Yeah, but remember, oh. it's, it's class hours, not clock hours. So, no hora clase, no hora reloj. That's different. Um, yeah, different. Yeah, it's 45 minutes. A 45 minutes class. Yeah, but eh, it's... Man, the, the afternoon shift is crazy because I start teaching at 12.30. At twelve thirty, at las doce treinta. Man, it's hot at that time. That's the hour, the most terrible hour for me is from twelve thirty to two p.m. Man, that's heavy time for me. That's when I drink uh, like two cups of coffee usually. Me cruzo mi dos tazas de café. One with lunch and what around one thirty. Oh, I'm a, I'm a coffee drinker. I drink a lot of coffee. Well, Carlos, nice talking to you and welcome. Okay, thank you. No, oh, thanks to you. Okie dokie, guys. Let's see. Well, let me tell you. Today we are going to start changing a little bit the, the dynamics of the class. And I will explain to you why. Let's explain por qué. The idea is for us to be like a... Like having conversations, but I want to vary the type of conversations, okay? Vamos a variar un poquito esto. It's going to be fun. You will like it. You will like it, okay? Uh, 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 um... Okay. Let me get the, the attendance before we start, okay? Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez Present teacher Carlos Miguel Umaña Lobo Present teacher Thank you Clelia Estela Flores de Molina Present Thank you Clelia Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Thank you, Diana. Present, teacher. Thank you, Eric. Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra. Present, teacher. Thank you, Irving. Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas. She's driving. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. Present, teacher. Thank you. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Thank you, Mr. Okay, Jose Alfredo Hueso Lopez. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Lady Joana Hernandez Ventura. Present teacher. Thank you. Marjorie Angelica Ardón Granillo. Present. Thank you. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Castillo. Oh, yeah. Vasquez Galvez, I'm sorry. Okay, present. Sorry, sorry. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Present. Santos Claudia Pineda. Present. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present. Thank you. Walter Ernesto Pérez Galvez. Present teacher. Thank you. Okay. That's nice. I got almost full house and that's great. That's awesome. Well, I still got a few minutes. Uh, yeah, still got a couple of minutes to have one-on-one -on -one conversations. Let's see who's going to be. 
Hello, Clelia. How are you? Hello. Fine. How's everything? ¿Qué tal todo? Bien. Yeah. Okay, what about your day? What did you do today? ¿Cómo estuvo el día? ¿Qué hizo? Um, my day was relaxed. Relax. Man, everybody's talk, telling me about a relaxing day. That's cool. Yes, um, in the morning, I, I went to the doctor um, then to work. Okay. Going to the doctor was the, the relaxing part. Relax. Okay, that's cool. So glad to hear it. So you could like rest a little bit of the routine. Yeah. That's nice. That's nice. That's excellent. So what time did you finish working today? Um, 50 p.m. Okay, 5, 5 p.m. And at what time did yes. you get to your job? At what time did you check in? Uh, pardon. What time did you check in? Check in es cuando marcamos la entrada. Ah, uh, at uh, 7, 7 a.m. Okay, that's a long day. Está largo así. Mm -hmm. Well, Clelia, nice having you here. Welcome. Airbnb. Hello, teacher. Hello, mister. How's everything? Uh, excuse me? How's everything? ¿Qué tal todo? So, so. So, so. Okay, okay. A long day at work? Um, sí. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's, it's a new project. Oh. Uh, um, entonces, it's demanding. It's demanding. Uh, mm, uh, driving uh, the Sonsonate or Santa Ana. From Sonsonate to Santa Ana. From Sonsonate to Santa Ana. Um, mm, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. I live in, in, in Santa Ana. Uh, uh, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Uh, uh, I stay in San Sonate. Okay. Wow. Uh, 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 it was, that's, uh, that's difficult. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, um, uh, people in my working and my working uh, is new uh, um, so you have to train approximately 24 personas oh my gosh so you are supervising and and training and explaining oh that's yeah. hard that's hard work yeah, um, I, i'm sorry for the time I had driving y, y no, 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 no encuentro eh, muchas veces me toca conectarme un poco pasada la hora por esa situación. No problem, I understand, I understand. Well, if you can, if you can connect while you are driving, you connect and just listen. Solo conectes y escuchen, no problem. Yeah, yeah. Eh, solo que algunas ocasiones tengo problemas de conexión. Yeah, I know, I know the role. Me imagino la calle, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, so when you are going from Sonsonate to Santa Ana, which way do you go? ¿Por qué ruta se va? From Sonsonate to Santa Ana. Los Naranjos. Okay, so you pass by next, close to La Majada, and you keep on going up. Um, no, 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 you go no, straight, no. you go straight. Uh, se va recto, yeah, yeah, I remember. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I I drive that route for fun. Yo la manejo por por diversión, but once on a while, pero allá el tiempo is not the same as 
as that regularly? Yeah, um, in the morning, uh, four chips. Uh, in the night. Uh, at night. At night. Uh, seven, seven chips. Yeah. Approx approximately. Yeah, that's Approximate. crazy. That's crazy. But, man, what we got to do? ¿Qué le vamos a hacer, right? Yeah, yeah. Now, well, the good thing is that you are here. You are here, okay? Don't worry. Uh, and good uh, is um, I love my 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 working. Yeah, that's nice. Even if it's tough, to start the case, a little bit difficult, but it's good that you that you enjoy what you do. Es bueno disfrutar lo que uno hace. Yeah. Yeah, that helps. That helps a lot. Eso ayuda mucho. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no, believe me, believe me. Oh, sometimes it happens to me that it's like it's like uh nine thirty or ten. I am teaching and I'm like, man, I need to stay awake, and I'm like, oh gone. But but it happens once in a while. De vez en cuando pasa. I mean it's it's not easy. But it's cool, it's part of the job. Irving, nice having you here. Welcome. Thank you. Okay, guys. Now, I will introduce to you a new type of activity. Les voy a presentar un nuevo tipo de actividad. I will explain it in English and Spanish so it's clear. Se la voy a explicar en inglés y español, así les queda claro. The idea is this. Uh, we are going to be having a little conversations. Vamos a estar teniendo pequeñas conversaciones. Okay? But those conversations are going to be developed in groups. Se van a desarrollar en grupos. I will be giving you perhaps one topic about un tema or perhaps like three or four questions, tres o cuatro preguntas. You are going to be asking and answering each other. Se las van a preguntar entre ustedes. And then when we come back, I will pick some of you and ask randomly. Y cuando regresamos a la sala principal, voy a escoger unos cuantos de ustedes y al azar y voy a preguntarles. The same questions, okay? The idea is for you to interact with different people. I will be switching the groups from class to class, or perhaps in the same class, you're going to be working with four or five different persons. Puede ser que en la misma clase usted trabaje con cuatro o cinco personas distintas. The idea is for you to interact, not for me to speak, and not for you to speak just with me. La idea no es que solo yo hable. No, y no es que hablen solo conmigo because I mean when you are speaking English in a, in our normal situation you speak it with different persons so you need to get used to different accents to different vocabulary nos vamos a acostumbrar a diferentes acentos diferentes vocabulario so it's gonna be fun believe me and this is a, a a very nice activity I hope you enjoy it es una actividad muy bonita espero que la 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 you enjoy it Okay, so the first topic we are going to be we are going to talk about physical appearance. You know, it's what do you think? Uh, is it important the physical appearance? Is it important how people dress? Es importante cómo las personas se visten, their appearance, cómo se ven, like a uh, Mm, like I don't know. Uh, some people don't like people with beard. No, no les parece las personas con barba. Some people say that it's okay. Some people dress like uh, don't like dressing with long sleeve shirts. Algunos no les gusta manga larga. Some people do. Okay. Uh, some people dress like very formal. So people think like, ah, no, the clothing is not important. Okay. So that's what we are going to ask each other. If you notice, the first question is, what is the first thing you notice about a person? What is the first thing you notice about a person? I will role play for you. Vamos a representar el tipo de actividad so you can understand what we're going to do. Ruth, please open your microphone. <laughs> Okay, Ruth, tell me, what is the first thing you notice about a person? When you first met someone, cuando conoce a alguien, what is the first thing you notice? ¿Qué es lo, en lo primero que se fija? 
creo que me fijo en la pared. Ok, but what about it? The, you look at the shoes, the shirt, or the dressing, the hair. In general. Everything at all. Complete. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, do you think, is it important how people dress? Uh, in my opinion, yes. <laughs> okay, why? Why is it important? ¿Por qué? Creo que dice mucho la... la okay, la, it tells about... It tells about the person. Dice algo. It tells sí. something about the person. Okay. Now, is weight or physical well-being, fitness important? What do you think? In, in general, opinion, in no. general terms, <laughs> en términos generales, is that important? No, very, really. very important. No, for salud, probably. Okay, for health, Pero most no. probably. Okay, for but cuidado, for yeah, but it's not something that is going to make you judge someone. No es algo que lo va a hacer juzgar a alguien, right? Okay, perfect. Thank you. Now, I got one last question. What is the most important? Clothes, shoes, hair, hygiene, fitness, or style? What do you think? Which is the most important for you? ¿Cuál es la más importante? Among all those. Creo que nunca me había puesto a pensar en eso. <laughs> well, you gotta think it because you're gonna talk with your classmates about that. Okay, guys, that's what you're going to do. Eso es lo que van a hacer. Any question about the activity? ¿Alguna pregunta con actividad? No. no? Okay, guys. You're going to be divided in groups of three members. Nos vamos a reunir en grupos de tres. You will have seven minutes for this activity. Van a tener siete minutos. I will be jumping from group to group. Voy a ir de grupo en grupo. And if you need any help, give me a holler. Si necesitan ayuda, me llaman allí. Okay? So, let's jump in. Let's do it. Hello. Uh, hello. 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 The the question is, what is the first thing you notice about the person? In my opinion, <clears throat> the the dress is important for a job. Uh, but uh, in only the job uh, in trabajos is depending on the job many on the job it's important uh, there is a format or use a uh, um what do you say uh Uniform. Wear, wear a uniform. Wear, wear a uniform. Yes, but it's it's, it's, it's important on the on the job. And in my opinion, it's more important the hygiene 
hygiene hygiene hi hi hygiene hi hygiene it's my my, my opinion <clears throat> Okay, Walter, you can ask them. Usted puede preguntarles. You got Claudia and Clelia there. Okay. And uh, Claudia, what is your opinion for the for the this this answer? For the for the question, for the first. I and I think the presentation is important in, in, in our in our work because because important because I think I, I think um, nuestra imagen. Our, our image presentation. Our image, our image, our image um, is well, in my work, in my case, but, because I work for a bank. Every day I uh, every day I talk to a lot of people and I need I need be I need be a good presentation. I think at uh, instructor, instructor, instructor Ojin, then in, okay. I don't see if it's is fat or skinny. I I see uh the person how how is their edu education has speak the pronunciation words if it, if if the person don't say bad words for example when they out speak it or or como se dice tipo de trabajo type 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 for 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 work Hmm. That would be interesting. That would be interesting. I mean, it would be interesting you seeing me on a regular day. Sería interesante que me vieran en un día libre. <laughs> yeah, the thing is this. I dress formal all the time for work. Yo me he visto formal todo el tiempo. So, whenever I have a free time, you will not see me wearing shoes. No me van a ver con zapatos. I'm always with sandals and shorts and t-shirt and that's on for me on the weekend I, I work weekends yo trabajo los fines de semana oh, okay. oh. so when i work sundays trabajo hasta los domingos so if i have sometimes i have sundays afternoon a veces tengo los domingos por la tarde so you will see me just wearing like sandals and shorts and that's for everything y eso es para todo that's for going to the for going to the mall, for going to the supermarket, for visit relatives, whatever. I mean, I get like <laughs> relax. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sometimes I'm driving barefoot. Uh, you see, voy manejando y, and I get tired, I drive barefoot. Y si me toca manejar ese día, descalzo. Hey, the shoes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's just... Relax. Yeah. Yeah, relax, completely relax. I like to. <laughs> yeah, man. It's just that sometimes, uh, as I tell you, I mean, 
like tomorrow, tomorrow I'll be working from 7 a.m. until 11 p.m. Mañana me toca trabajar desde las 7 de la mañana hasta las 11 de la noche. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Okay, much, much, much money. <laughs> no, many debts. <laughs> No, muchas deudas. That's the problem. Oh. <laughs> that's the problem. Como no le gustan las pupusas. Yeah, that's why. That's why. No, I got a son at the university. Tengo un hijo en la universidad. Man, that thing's oh. terrible. That's <laughs> terrible. Horrible. Terrible. Yeah, I despair. Okay, guys. Well, it's almost time to go back to the main room. time to call everybody back. Let's see, everybody's coming back. So we'll be in a couple of seconds. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Let's see who's going to be first. Uh, man, the screen is moving. Angelica. Yes, you, you are. You are the one. You are the chosen one. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So tell me, what is the first thing you notice about a person? Um, and your hygiene. Hygiene, okay. Hygiene, yes. Okay. So you would like me to shave. O sea, que usted me manda a rasurar. No. Um, oh, even si está worse. La barba bien arreglada, you... Si está bien arreglada la barba, limpiecita. Oh, even worse, you want problema. me to, to shower? No, man. Peor aún, me manda por una ducha. That's terrible. Mándalo a resurar. Yeah, that's terrible. No, you know, my bird is white. I'm working on it for, for, for Christmas. Como ya está blanca, estoy esperando por, for Christmas. I want an extra job. Yeah, that's, that's the problem. Oh, Santa. Yeah, yeah, I need, I need to gain some weight and get it bigger así más peso and as as wide as it is getting así como me está encareciendo it's gonna be easy okay thank you okay. so let's see eric what about you what is the first thing you notice in a person um and they speak polite oh the way they speak hmm. yes uh, education okay okay yeah. Excellent. Thank you. No, that's, that's okay. That's okay. Great. Great. 
Let's see. Walter, Walter Ernesto. Hey, teacher. Okay, so tell me, do you think is is it important how people dress? Uh, uh, my opinion is important for the, the job. In, mm -hmm. But it's more important the high, high, hygiene. Hygiene, yes. It's more important. Oh, but okay. it's is 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 the dress is 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 uh in my opinion is only the the job okay. but every day the hygiene is is important yeah. okay so man it's crazy guys you want me to shave to apply the odorant <laughs> todavía quieren que no ponga su odorante no man it's natural. Yeah, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. In the morning, I take a shower. <laughs> yeah, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah, Ruth is like this. I can feel it here, she said. Yes. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> Otherwise, she will be like, oh my gosh, no, terrible, terrible. Okay, thank you. Nilton. Okay. Hi. Well, Nilton, tell me, tell me, which is the most important from your on your opinion? Clothes, shoes, hair, hygiene, fitness, style. What's the most important? Uh, in my case, the most important is hygiene and hygiene, fitness. Yes, and, and fitness. fitness. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well. Yeah, fitness, it's good. If it's if it's because of your health, it's good. Uh, fitness is, is for salud. Es yeah, para, health. Ben, health. Para la salud, pero no, yeah. no es necesario. Pues, pues, yeah, sí. you don't Ay, need you to be like, salir. yeah. Yeah, no, actually it helps. It Ish. helps. You know, I to be honest with you i started going to the gym very late in my life Yo comencé a hacer ejercicio very late when i was young i used to practice different sports i used to practice basketball volleyball i used to go cycling bicicleta, but now you don't get me on a bicycle man i cannot even imagine me going the the, the way i used to Ni loco, creo que me tomaría un viaje de los que antes hacía. I mean, that's crazy. But, yeah, it's it's different. But as you say, yeah, if it's for health, it's cool. Si es por salud, it's great. Okay, thank you guys. Now, I need to take a poll. Necesito tomar una pequeña encuesta. How did you like this type of activity? ¿Qué les pareció ese tipo de actividad? Is it okay? Yes, it's okay. Yes, very good. It's okay. Very, 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 very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Okay, great, great, great. It's because fine. we're going to do it again at the end. Vamos a hacer otra entonces al final. We're going to have okay. the chance to have another one. I will give you another topic and we will discuss. The idea is for you to think out of this context. La idea es que pensemos fuera de este contexto. That's why the topics are going to vary. Los temas van a ir variando. Okay. Well, now we go to the manual. We need to cover something a little bit from the manual. Tenemos que cubrir un poco del manual, you know? Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. And yesterday we were working, doing a little something in page number 12 on your on your manual, if you remember. Si se recuerdan, estábamos en la página 14. On your manual. And today we are going to finish that exercise. The one that you were doing right at the end. Just give me one second that I'm getting it ready. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where is it? Oh my gosh. Yeah, page 12, 12, 12. Where did it go? Uh, 
اه Okay, guys. Now I got it. I'm so sorry for the delay. Let me share with you. Okay, we were doing this. Do you remember the what clauses? The what clauses. Remember, all this is a subject. Todo esto es un sujeto. Usually followed by the verb be. If you notice here, the verb be. And the order in which you were going to apply them was... Exactly the same order. El orden que vamos a utilizar era este. My best friend just opened his own shop. Okay. So the answer. What was the answer for this? What she needed was open it in a good mall. Many people want to start their own business. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. In this one is, okay, my best friend just opened his own shop. What my friend did was open it in a good mall, right? Goes like this, so you can have it like, okay. This one, oops. This one is like this. What my friend did was open it in a good mall. Many people want to start their own business. What's the answer here, guys? It's not information. Mm. Whether I want to sell me friend new market. In this mm -hmm. case is what, what you, you need. What she needs is lots of information. Lo que necesitas es mucha información. Okay? What she needs is lots of information. Many people want to start their own business. Muchas personas quieren comenzar su negocio. What she needs is lots of information. Lo que necesitas es mucha información. I don't know where she has to start. What I am saying is about the products online. In this case is what I will do. What I will do is sell my product in new markets. What I will do is Perfect. promote the products online. Yeah, that's another option. What I will do is uh, get to, for new markets, right? Now, in this one, the last one, people don't buy new products because they can't. What, saying that. what I'm saying is there is no demand. Got it? What my friend did was open it in a good mall. Okay, guys. Questions about the exercise? Not sure. Okie dokie, let's see guys, I'm gonna share the answers. Uh, 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 uh. Let me just see if I can make it shorter. Okay, there you go. Now, next exercise, next exercise. Let me share with you guys again because we continue with the manual. Oops. Before we, we move on, let me get the neck, the attendance one more time, okay? Antes de continuar, déjeme la attendance. Okay. Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Present teacher. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present teacher. Carlos Miguel Umaña Lobo. 
Present teacher. Clelia Estela Flores de Molina. Present. Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo. Present. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra. Present teacher. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. Present teacher. Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas. Present teacher entrando a casa. Great, great. That's cool. So glad to hear it. José Alfredo Hueso López. Present teacher. Present Julio teacher. César Aguillón Arevalo. Lady Joana Hernández Ventura. Present teacher. Marjorie Angélica Ardón Granillo. Present. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Galvez. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present teacher. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Rivera. Arevalo. Arevalo, I'm sorry. Man, I need to get new glasses, perhaps. Creo que necesito lentes nuevos. I'm sorry, guys. Santos Claudia Pineda. Present. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present teacher. Walter Ernesto Pérez Galvez. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Now, let me share with you. Mm -hmm. Okay, we go to page number 13. We are going to talk about manufacturing, okay? First off, what is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? What is the most important thing for you? That's very interesting, you see? What is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a, a product? What is the most important thing for you? Okay, two questions, very quick, okay? We are going to do it like this. Lo vamos a hacer de esta manera, okay? You're going to go work in groups, but now the activity is going to be a little bit different, okay? How so? Como así? I will explain to you. Group number one. It's Ana Marlene, Nilton, Rafael, Veronica, Elizabeth, and Walter Ernesto. Veronica, Elizabeth, you yes. are in charge of asking the questions to your classmates. Usted está a cargo de hacerle las preguntas a sus compañeros. Okay? Thanks. Room number two, Claudia Pineda, Clelia Estela, Diana Maribel, Eric Josué, Jocelyn Keren. Claudia Pineda, you are in charge of asking the questions. Group three. Ana Verónica, Carlos Miguel, José Alfredo, Ruth Asensio. Ana Verónica, you are asking the question. Usted pregunta. And group four, Irvin Escamilla, Iván Alberto, Lady Joana, Marjorie Angélica. Lady, you are asking the questions. Okay? I'm going to send the questions to the group also. So you can have them. Yo les mando las preguntas. Four minutes for this activity. Let's hurry up. What is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
Bueno, ahí está mi procesor. Ah. Ok. Ok. Pues sí, ¿verdad? Esas son las que me mandó a mí el grupo. ¿La vieron en el grupo? Ahorita reviso si son. Yes, ahorita. I just send them to you to the chat also. También se las mandé al oh, chat okay. acá. Ok. 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 Okay, what what is I will ask you to you classmate, what is the first thing you pay attention to when you buying a product? I pay attention. What is the first the thing quality. you pay attention to when buying a product? Is the first question. The two question is what is the most important thing for you? What is la la cosa más importante para ti? Edit. Edit. Yes. What is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? The first. Uh, the first thing. Okay. Uh, in the quality, the product. The quality. Yes. La uh, yes. And como la calidad del producto. Yes. Estela. What is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? And um, quality and price. Quality and price. También puede ser el precio o el price. The price, sí. Yeah, and the price. Mm. Diana, Diana, hola. What is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? Uh, Su precio, creo. Price, quality. What is the most important thing for you? <laughs> Jocelyn, what is the most important thing for you? spell please D U uh, E D A T E okay. ok también lo podemos ver eh, también lo podemos escribir en el chat para que tal vez se le haga un poquito más fácil <laughs> a, a lady what do you need lady the questions Do oh, it's separate. Do it, uh-huh. What? The due date. The due date. Mister, es que les estaba preguntando y estaba como escribiendo su respuesta. Okay, great, mm -hmm. great, great. Mm -hmm. And you, Ivan, what is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? Mm, the price. The price. In my case, is presentation. Mm. 
Mister, uh, how do you say? Um, uh, buena calidad o good quality. Good quality. Ah, okay. That was, it's a correct. For me, it's good quality. Okay, and what is the most important thing you think for you? For me, it's good quality and the product. And you, Irving? Uh, look good, good quality. Julio? The three V. <laughs> and the uh, English, I think that is different. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. mm -hmm. Most probably. Uh huh, because como acá es trepe. Sixty seconds, guys. Okay, let's see, everybody's coming back. Okay, let's see. Group number one, who's going to, to talk to me? Who's going to give me the information? Okay, sure. Who's? Okay, Veronica, tell me about one or two of your classmates' answers. Okay, about my classmate. Um, oh, my God, I forget her, her name. His name. <laughs> <laughs> but the, the my clients tell me told me them uh 
the first thing uh, he pay attention to when buying a pearl is the price. The both classmates told me the price first. And then uh, the most important thing for, for, for his is, is the quality. But the, finally he told me he, the brand is too important too. Okay, perfect. Group number two. The opinion of my classmates are they unfair, price, quality, uh, but in the most important, the price. Okay, perfect. Okay, group number three. Okay, tell me now, Veronica. Uh, they look at price, quality, payment method, uh, offers, and brands. The most important uh, thing is price and quality. Okay, thank you. And the last group? Um. Nearly all sides, but good quality and good price. Okay, excellent, excellent. Now, let's continue. Next activity. We got a conversation. We got a conversation in the manual. Okay. Let me share with you so you can practice. Here we go. And the conversation goes like this. Look, the instruction is listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a partner, okay? And the conversation goes like this. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Ms. Nunez, and I'm going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Ms. Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in charge of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push this rail button. Second, grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure each meets the specifications in this chart. Third, place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pieces. I repeat. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Ms. Nunez and I'm going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Ms. Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in charge of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push this red button. Second, grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure each meets the specifications in this chart. Third, Place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pieces. Okay, guys. And now you go and work in pairs in order to practice the conversation. I just sent you the audio. And let me send you to the groups. Okay, let's see. Okay, you're going to be working 
today is going to be different. You're going to be in pairs and groups of three. Okay. So groups are ready. You need to practice with more than one person. Okay. your belt please push this red button second grab a pair of tongue and pick every piece of chocolate read this chart and shake every piece make sure each meets the specification in the chart here place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective piece. Está bien larga esa parte. Bueno, empiezo hoy tú. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day of the...
English, you are in I'm stopping the cover your bed. Please push this red button. Second, grab a pair of thongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure each needs the specification in this chart. Third, place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, fill in a, a report at the end of the day about the defective piece. Okay. okay. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day of the plant. My name is Miss Nunez, and I am going to explain what you must do in the production line. Sixty seconds, guys. Ok, let's see. Irving Escamilla and Nilton Vasquez. Irving, you start. Uh, sure. Uh, Podría compartir pantalla. Nilton. Hello, hello. I am ready. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day uh, at the plant. My name is Miss Nunez, and I am going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Miss Nunez. Where do we start? Uh, first, you are in the shirt uh, of stopping the combination belt. Please push this red button. And second, grab a pair of the tongs and pick every piece of the chocolate. Read, read this shirt and check every piece. Make sure it meet the specification in the shirt. Shirt, uh, please the defective chocolate in the funnel. Finally, fill in report at the end of the day about the definite piece. Okay, thank you. Ana Marlene and Carlos Miguel. Okay. Ana Marlene, you start. Okay. Mm. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first date at the plant. My name is Miss Nunez and I'm going to explain what you must do in the production line. Uh, nice to meet you, Miss Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in charge of 
stopping the conveyor belt. Please push this red button. Second, grab a pair of thongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this shirt and shake every piece. Oh, Make sure each meets the specification in this shirt. Third, place the def defective chocolate in the funnel. Finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pieces. Fill in, fill in. Okay, Claudia Pineda and Clelia. Clelia, you start. Clelia? No, perdón. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at. My name is Lelia. Hello. Yeah, you continue. My name is Miss Nunez. Uh, the plan. My name is Miss Nunez, and I going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Mister Miss Nunez. Where do you will start? First, you are in charge of. Stopping the, stopping the. The conveyor belt. Okay, the conveyor belt, please push this red button. Second, grab a pair of stones and pick every piece of chocolate with this shirt and check every piece. Make sure it meets the specific in this chart. There place the defective chocolate in this corner finally fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective piece. Defective pieces. Defective. Eric Josué and Ivan Alberto. Ivan, you start. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Miss, you, Miss Nunez, and I'm going to explain what you must do in the product line. Nice to meet you, Mr. Mrs. Nunez. Where do you will start? First, you are in charge char of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push there. Red button, second grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. My sure age meets the specification in this chart. Third, place the, the, the defective chocolate in this tunnel. Finally, filling a report at the in the of the day about the detective pieces. Defective pieces. Defective pieces. Okay, thank you. Jose Alfredo and Julio Aguillon. Ready, guys? Yes. Yes. Okay, perfect. Jose Alfredo, you start. Okay, thank you. Sure. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at. You continue. Yes. So day at the plant. You continue up to here. Continue hasta acá. Ah, okay, perdón. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Miss Nunez, and I'm going to explain. Explain. Yep. When you must do 
in the production line. Nice to meet you, Miss Nunes. Where do we do start? First, you are you are in chance of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push this red button. And second grab a pan of tacks and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure it meets the specification in this chart. A chart. And there's oh, three, no, three play. And replace the third, detective third, play. third, 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 como que fuera una Z. Third. Ah, third. Third place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, fill in the report and at the end of the day uh, about the defective piece. About the defective pieces. Perfect. Thank you, mister. Thank you, teacher. Lady Joanna and Marjorie. Ready, ladies? Yes. Okay, you start, lady. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Miss Nunez, and I am going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Miss Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in chair of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push the red button. Second, grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure it meets the specification in this chart. Third, place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pies. Pieces, defective pieces. Defective pieces. Thank you. Thanks to you. Rafael Antonio and Ruth Asensio. Ruth, you start. Okay, teacher. Um, hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plane. The plane. My name is Miss Nunez, and I'm going to explain what you, you must do in the production online. Rafael. One moment, teacher. Uh, he's parking. One, one moment. Okay, no problem, no problem. I'll help you out. Nice to meet you, Miss Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in charge of stopping the convert bill. Please push this red button. Second, grab a pair of toe and pick every piece, piece. Uh, every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure each meet meets and the specification in this chart. Fear place the defective chocolate in the this final uh, no final finally filling a report at the end, end of the day about the def defective pieces. Okay, perfect, thank you. Veronica Elizabeth and Walter Ernesto. 
Okay. Who we'll start, teacher? Well, you, Veronica. Okay. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Miss Nunez, and I'm going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Mr. Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in charge of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push this red button. Second, grab a, a pair of stone and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure it meets the specification in this chart. Third, play the effective chocolate. If this funnel finally fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pieces. Defective. 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 Defective pieces. Okay, perfect, guys. Thank you very much. I know it was long. Let me read it one more time for you. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Miss Nunez, and I'm going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Miss Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in charge of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push this red, this red button. Second, grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure each meets the specifications in this chart. Third, Place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pieces. Okay, guys, now the imperatives. The imperatives are used to give an order, to give instructions, or to make invitations. Imperatives do not have a subject. This is very important. Imperatives do not have a subject. If you check out in the examples, every one of them starts with a verb. Read, unplug, fill in, verify. Okay, now, the imperatives are very interesting, you know, because usually they have always told us that uh, in English, you always need to have a subject. Siempre nos han dicho que en inglés hay que poner un sujeto, right? Always. You need a subject all the time, but with the exception of when you are talking about imperatives, con excepción de los imperativos. Those are actually, well, they are used to give instructions, but if the person saying it to you is in a position of superiority, it's an order. Si quien se lo dice a ustedes, el jefe, eso es una orden. Okay? That they tell, they call Irving. Irving, we need you tomorrow at 6 a.m. at the office. 6 a.m. But it's an order. Okay? So, another way to say it is like, hey, Irving. And Irving goes like, hello, how are you? And then he listens. Come to the office tomorrow at 6 a.m., please. The please is just for it to sound like softer, but it's an order, right? Si, si es el jefe que se lo dice uno, aunque le ponga el please... It's still an order. Now, something very important is, if you notice, they start with the verb. Comienzan con el verbo. We see them all around. Lo vemos por todas partes. Like, um, close the door. And don't step on the grass. No se pare en la grama. Close the door. Uh, apply alcohol. Okay. Aplique ese alcohol. And they are instructions if you work with machinery. Si se trabaja con maquinaria, instrucciones. I mean, if you read the instructions over there, usted lee, lee las instrucciones, right? If, if you have my cooking skills, si usted tiene mis habilidades culinarias, when I get a soup, the other day I was checking out. El otro día estaba viendo la sopa y decía, open, pour boiled water. Decía, abra, déjele caer agua hirviendo. Let it rest for a few minutes. Déjelo descansar unos minutos. And then, lunch. Simple. You see? But the instructions, if you notice, they start always with a verb. Siempre comienzan con un verbo. Okay? So, that's 
that's actually the goal of the of the the, 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 the imperatives to give an instruction okay you can use it like in the example that you got with the conversation about giving the steps about something pueden verlo como para dar los pasos para lograr algo okay first if you notice first then after but if you notice after each of those words straight to the verb the subject is always you el sujeto siempre es you in those situations okay any question preguntas no okay guys let's see oh my gosh somebody left two students left before we move on, I need to give you an extra assignment. Okay, this is an extra assignment. It's just for me. Le voy a dejar una tarea extra. Don't worry, it's not for tomorrow. Not para mañana, don't worry. It's for the end of the course. It's para el final del curso. At the end of the course, uh, you will have three minutes assigned. Va a tener tres minutos asignados. To give a little presentation. Para hacer una pequeña presentación. The topic is open. El tema es abierto. Whatever you want to talk about. De lo que sea que usted quiera hablar. I mean, if uh, José Alfredo wants to talk about pollution, okay, we're going to listen about pollution. Si José Alfredo quiere hablar acerca de la contaminación, vamos a escuchar de la contaminación. Okay. Uh, if you want to talk about violence, if you want to talk about soccer, if you want to talk about your family, whatever. But you need to be speaking in English for three minutes, minimum. Pero necesita prepararse para hablarme en inglés por tres minutos, mínimo. Okay? That's our goal for this module. Esa es nuestra meta para este módulo. Okay, guys? Any question? Preguntas? Now, okay, now, just remember, if you need any help, uh, if you are preparing something, si usted comienza a preparar algo and necesita ayuda, let me know, you can contact me. Pueden contactarme, that's not a problem, okay? I will gladly help you. If you need help with the pronunciation or perhaps with a sentence, si necesitan ayuda con una, la pronunciación o quizás una oración, let me know, I'm here to help, okay? Remember, you can just open your your microphone and start talking. Puedes simplemente abrir su micrófono y comenzar a hablar. That's not a problem. Ese no es un problema. Or you can prepare a PPT. Puede preparar una presentación. That's okay. Just remember, not third parties. Solo recuérdense, no podemos poner videos ni imágenes que estén protegidas por derechos de autor. Okay? Otherwise, we're in trouble. Si no, si estamos en problemitas. Okay? But... If you want, just open the microphone and start talking. Si no, simplemente abra el micrófono y comience a hablar. The idea is for you to be speaking. That's what I'm interested in. Lo que me interesa es escucharlos hablar. Okay? That's going to be a very interesting experience for you. Va a ser una muy buena experiencia para ustedes. I'm sure you're going to enjoy it. Okay? I will be reminding you every week. Le voy a estar recordando cada semana. I know that you are busy. You got your obligations, responsibilities, but it's a good practice, but it's una buena practica. Okay, questions? No questions? Okay, tomorrow we're gonna do an extra activity about the imperatives. Mañana vamos a hacer una actividad extra de los imperativos. It's gonna be interesting. Va a ser interesante. You are going to give me instructions about something, but I will tell you what tomorrow. Yo les diré mañana. Before we move on, we still got a couple of minutes. And if you remember right at the beginning, I told you that you were going to be like uh, having a little conversation. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, where is it? Where is it? Oh, here. We're going to talk about people. 
Okay, guys, just two questions because it's not, there's not a lot of time. The questions are very interesting. We're going to talk about people, okay? Okay. Mm, sometimes people, you know, people is, are interesting. I mean, you get to meet people and that's cool, but do people have habits that annoy you? Personas tienen hábitos que sean molestos para usted? Do you annoy people with some of your habits? Habits? ¿Qué tal si somos nosotros los que molestamos a los demás con, con nuestros hábitos? That happens. I mean, could be, could happen. Perhaps the way we speak. Some people is like, uh, and perhaps you know it. So we're going to ask those questions to each other. Okay, guys? And we're going to keep on working in groups of three members. So you're going to have four minutes to ask an answer. I want to hear everybody participating. Uh, ahorita las pido. Teacher, excuse yes. me. You, can you share the, the questions? The questions, please? sure, yes, sure. Please. Give me one second and I'll give them okay. to you right about. Uh, 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 where are they? Huh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me a second, give me a second, give me a second. Something's going on. Oh, I hate this. Give me just one second and let's see. And there you go. I am not, I am not kidding. Uh, hay gente que molesta que, o sea, a mí me molesta que no sean ordenados también. <laughs> <laughs> Yo creo que eso les molesta a algunos, que uno exige orden. <laughs> I think that, uh, como que somos iguales, porque en mi casa en la oficina les muy exigente, es como ah, sí. vimos que esto se iba a hacer, entonces tiene que salir para la fecha porque es como proyecto, ¿verdad? Ah, entonces sí. los 
los, co los cooperantes nos están pidiendo como avances y todo. Así que... They make song while sharing when fun. Each. Uh -huh. When they make songs while sharing fun. Put. Cuando Food hacen un sonido food. al masticar la comida. Yes. That's horrible. <laughs> Cuando Shoo toman la sopa como, como, so, como sopilote. Yeah. Oh, slurping. Slurping. It's slurping. Yeah. Yeah. Hola. Hola. <laughs> okay. Mm. In my case, when um. the people talk loud and loud. Ah. Um. Uh, in my case, uh, when people make a lot of noise in a small space with music, videos, and other. Okay, the second question. Um, ¿Cuál era la otra? No, no solo la primera, solo una era. No, no. Two. Espérate que ahí le mando el WhatsApp. Ah, okay. Um, uh, okay. If you are no people with some no of your habits, no yeah. No, no sé, no sé, vea. No es sé que si lo escribe en el chat. Ajá, ajá. <laughs> okay guys let's see let's see Irving hello teacher tell me do people have habits that annoy you uh, uh, it's a uh, uh, bother me that a uh, saleswoman uh, blow her not a lot oh yeah yeah <laughs> I can imagine yeah Sí. Yeah, that's annoying. That's annoying. Oh, what about you, Ana Verónica? Uh, I am bothered by the noise when I hit. Okay. Que hagan ruido cuando come. 
when people eat, yeah, yeah, it's annoying, it's annoying. Yeah, everybody's got little something. All of us got little something that perhaps other people don't like. Well, guys, I'm so sorry that I cannot ask each one of you, but it was a very interesting practice. And right now, let me... Let me get the final attendance, please. Let's see, where is it? Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Ana Marlene Andrade de Osorio. Present teacher. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present teacher. Carlos Miguel Lumaña Lobo. Present teacher. Clelia Estela Flores de Molina. Present. Diana Maribel Hueso Portillo. Present. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present teacher. Irving Otoniel Escamilla Guerra. Present teacher. Iván Alberto Castillo Alas. Present teacher. Jocelyn Karen Meléndez Rivas. José Alfredo Hueso López. Julio Present César. Teacher. Thank you. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present teacher. Lady Joana Hernández Ventura. Present teacher. Marjorie Angélica Ardón Granillo. Present. Nilton Alexander Vázquez Galvez. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Present. Santos Claudia Pineda. Present. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present teacher. Walter Ernesto Pérez Galvez. Present teacher. Hey guys. Thank you very much. It was a very good class. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. See you. See you tomorrow, teacher. Good night. Bye-bye. Good night. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Bye, Mr. Good night. Good night. Oops. Carlos, you were supposed to stay with me. What happened to you?
well, time's over. See you tomorrow.